Picture a troll, sturdy, massive, perhaps a bit unsightly. They lurk in the crevices of European folklore, predominantly from the snow-laden tales of Scandinavia and Norse mythology. Dwelling in isolation amidst towering mountains or dense forests, they've often been painted as dangerous entities. Now, shift your gaze to the Nephilim. These beings have their roots entwined in the sacred verses of Judeo-Christian traditions. The Bible speaks of them as the offspring of the ethereal sons of God and the earthly daughters of men, as penned in the book of Genesis. Trolls and Nephilim, both entrenched in mythology and folklore, yet they hail from disparate cultural and religious traditions. No historical or mythological sources weave a direct connection between them. The notion of trolls being Nephilim? It's likely a product of modern interpretation or a twist of creative reimagination.